let's lower this neon and uh, magnesium sorry and so they have uh, three stable isotopes compared to compared to um sodium and aluminium and so let's quickly look at the number of um protons and neutrons in this um, element so when you look at that of neon and then magnesium neon has a proton number of 10 and then a mass number of 20 and magnesium also has a proton number of 12 and then a mass number of 24 okay so now <clears throat> it's sodium sodium has a proton number of 11 and then a mass number of 23 and then aluminium has um, a mass number of 27 and then a proton number of 13. So you can see that with neon and magnesium, they have even, even number of protons and then neutrons. And we've already established that even number of nuclides with even number of protons and neutrons have better stability compared to those with odd number of either protons or neutrons or both. So this will be 12 and then that will be 12. And then compared to this, this will be um 11 and then that will be 12 and then this will be 13 and then that will be 14. so comparing this you can see that these ones they have more stable isotopes based on their actual number of neutrons to uh, proton um, numbers in the nuclear compared to uh, that of the sodium and then aluminum, we just only have one. So we know that odd numbered protons and neutrons are mostly less stable or have fewer stable nucleotides. Yeah, so it, it is due to the number of protons and neutrons in the nucleons of this nucleoid in the nucleus of this nucleus, that is the nucleus.